Hey guys, it's Shay from Wonderfully Chaotic and I apologize for the way that my voice sounds today. I have something funky going on with my throat um, and I kind of sound like a teenage boy half the time and the other time I sound like a 80 year smoker or something, I don't know. Anyway, I am here today with my Dollar Tree Halloween Shop With Me and Haul and um, I'm going to show you a couple videos of my trip to Dollar Tree yesterday right now. I didn't film a whole lot in there because um, the employees were kind of giving me the side eye when I was filming like What's going on over there? What is she doing? So I didn't want to like make them any more nervous than they already were. So <laughs> I just filmed a tiny bit. Um, so this is a collaboration with a bunch of other... Uh, I apologize. I had to stop for a minute because I looked in the monitor and realized that my earrings were upside down. In the last video I did, um, they were like crooked and upside down and crazy in it. And I didn't notice it until afterwards and it drove me nuts like afterwards. <laughs> and I'm sure there's somebody else out there who will probably comment and mention it or whatever but anyway so this is a collaboration and i'm going to link in the description box down below all of the other videos i would love for you to go check them out these ladies have all went and done their own little hauls and um it's neat to see what's different in the other stores um, in other places and to see what kind of deals they got and how they decorated and everything so now we're going to get to um the actual stuff that i've got here oh whoa camera what are you doing going crazy <laughs> so if you don't know what um dollar tree is dollar tree is a place where everything is a dollar which is pretty awesome so you can get some pretty good deals there um so i went and got some halloween and a couple fall themed things too because um they had some fall stuff out not a ton they had a little bit and so i decided to get um a couple things here are the things that i purchased i got us a new candy bowl for our trick-or-treaters I got um, this cute, let's see if I can get it all to hang up here correctly. It's just a cute little decoration to hang up. I think I'm gonna put it in our um, dining room um, where I have like, I kind of hang up like seasonal things. Like uh, I had a Christmas wreath there and then I just change it out um, for the different seasons. And I got some garland, which has spooky bats on it for our fireplace. I got some of these, I'm sure these were a big part of my childhood that I liked. These window clings that you stick to the window. My kids love these. So I got a couple different ones for them to put maybe on our front door or their bedroom windows, we'll see. Okay, next I got this sign, which I thought was cute, that I'm gonna hang on the front door. I usually have something up there. Don't have anything up there right now, but I've had different like signs for the seasons or wreaths or um, like I had a Christmas sign that I got from Dollar Tree, ironically, up there. <clears throat> oh, and then I got one for later on after Halloween's over with. I got um, a Thanksgiving one that I kind of liked. Um, let's see what else. Oh, I got these for the kids for um, for their pumpkins because sometimes we will carve them, but carving pumpkins is not one of my favorite things to do. I usually end up doing most of it because the kids get bored halfway through or it's too hard. So sometimes we will paint them or decorate them and I thought that these would be pretty simple. They're like felt pieces that you can like glue on. And lastly, I got a couple things for our front yard area. There's an a uh, grassy area right by um, our front porch that I'm going to decorate um, and kind of make spooky for Halloween. So I got a couple things. I think I'm actually going to go back and get a couple more because these were super cheap and it'll be cute and fun. So I got this uh, skeleton hand arm that glows in the dark and it's got a little stake thing so you can just stick it in the ground so it looks like it's sticking up. And then I got some signs. I got this one and I got that one and I think those will be neat. Um, they had more 
things like this that were like skulls and bones and all kinds of stuff. And I think I'm going to go get a couple more of those just to kind of round it out and make it look kind of neat in the front yard there for our trick-or-treaters and for us to enjoy. So I think that is it. Um, as I said, this is a collaboration with a bunch of other mamas and I would love it if you go and check out their videos because they spent a lot of time and um, making these videos and I know that they would really appreciate you going and checking them out. Um, this was really fun to do so I'm definitely going to try and do another video like this again in the future. Um, if you like this video, please let me know by hitting the like button and you can subscribe to our channel um, to see more videos like this and others where I don't sound like I am a teenage boy or a 80 year smoker or whatever description works right now. <laughs> um, I'm going to go rest my voice again um, for a little bit, maybe have some tea and try and figure out what's going on here. So thanks for sitting and visiting with me for a while, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.